San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria says he understands San Diegans are frustrated with the growing issue of homelessness. Today he announced more shelter beds are about to open up to help some of the city's most vulnerable. The city will transform a downtown hotel into a temporary shelter for seniors. CBS 8's Kelly Acidal joins us live from that hotel with what she's learned today. Kelly. That's right. The old Pacific Inn Hotel and Suites will soon be transformed into a homeless shelter for seniors. Now it's located right along Pacific Highway, right across the street from the county administration building and Waterfront Park. Outreach, shelter, housing, health care. This is how we end homelessness one person at a time. And we can't solve this crisis with one outreach event, one shelter opening or one housing project. It requires a sustained effort layers upon layers of programs, facilities, and policy reforms. Today's announcement is a part of that. And Mayor Gloria says 32 rooms here will be used as temporary homes for seniors. Uh, the city will clean them up, they'll furnish them, and they will soon be ready for folks to move into them. According to a recent study by the group Serving Seniors, one in four of San Diego's homeless adults is over the age of 55. More than 40% are experiencing homelessness for the first time in their lives. Uh, so the need for senior-focused help is certainly real. As you heard the mayor say, this hotel, though, is just one piece of a much bigger puzzle. Uh, he talked about about other things that the city is doing. Last week, another 150 bed shelter opened up on Rosecrans in the Midway District. Uh, they expanded the hours for a safe parking lot in Mission Valley. The city recently announced the old Central Library will be transformed into a new homeless shelter. Now, today we also heard from Council President Sean Elo Rivera, who says he was homeless 11 years ago, living out of his car. He said he'll always remember the day a friend helped him pay for a hotel room. I will never, ever forget the feeling of opening that door and seeing that bed and knowing that at least for one night, I would have a room of my own and a bed of my own. These rooms are going to offer that to the seniors who so very much need them. And it was mentioned today that sometimes people avoid shelters because they don't want to be in that group setting. So uh, this would give them an opportunity to have their own private room, their own private space. As for a time frame on when this shelter will open, uh, Mayor Gloria says he expects it to open within the next couple of months. Uh, Marcelo and Carlo. And Kelly, the homelessness crisis is so many things, including costly. Uh, what's the price tag on this new shelter? So the city will be leasing this hotel until June of 2023. They'll have the option to extend that lease for a couple of years beyond that. But for just this lease alone, it's going to cost about $725,000. Um, and that's not even including the cost of, of someone to operate uh, the shelter. So the Mayor Gloria believes that the price tag will come in right under a million dollars. Right, it's um, in the budget. Things need to be addressed and done. And this is some uh, action being taken. So we'll see how it plays out. Thanks so much, Kelly.